Hello! Now I'm back. <laughs> and it feels like I am crooked. Did I turn it now? Wait. Am I crooked? I'm sorry if I'm crooked. Today it's the part five of my Marlene and Linda's uh, Jeffree Star collab. And I'm putting primer on my eye while I'm talking. Today it's the video I have been longing for the most and sen Swedish since we decided what to do with the palettes. And I have obviously not done my base first, as you can see. Uh, but yeah, today we are doing something that is going to be so much fun. <laughs> Uh, Malin and Linda did this with in their Anastasia Beverly Hills series uh, and it's so much fun but today it's the alien palette <laughs> so it's number five and oh god I love this <laughs> and as you all know I don't know people bend their palettes back like this but I, oh, I don't feel like it and it looks like this there is 18 shades and for today, we are doing the thing um, where we have uh, a random number generator. So I have it here. And we are not allowed to place them wherever we want. So first, I'm going to take a number. Um, and I'm going like this. So this is shade 1, obviously. This is shade 8, and so on you get how I'm thinking and the first shade you get you will have to put in the crease uh, and the second shade you have to put in the outer V the third shade you have to put on the lid uh, the fourth shade is on the lower lash line the fifth shade is in the inner corner and then we have a sixth shade that you can put wherever you want so you can fix some of the stuff <laughs> and there are both shimmers and mattes in this palette let's see how many shimmers there are one two three four five six are there seven shimmers i think that means there are 11 mattes yeah Ooh. and i'm so excited and i really hope there are really dark shades in this palette so i'm kind of worried about the uh, inner corner <laughs> but yeah so uh, we are allowed to go back and you know blend and so on but the position is the position so ooh. <laughs> I'm so excited okay let's start five yeah that's good uh, so five that's that shade abduction that I will have in the crease and that is fine and I'm sorry if I'm crooked as I said but I I think I have it fixed so let's try that shade sorry it tickles in my eye I'm in the middle of what's it called redecorating uh, and my parents and my whole family is coming here tomorrow to um, my dad and my brother are going to build some Billy bookshelves for me so I can rearrange in here and for, sorry for please uh, oh that's good that I tickles now uh, and I will probably change my filming location when I have fixed that uh, but I have a lot to do today it's already six o'clock in the evening and I have a stuff to do but yeah, that's the way it is. Uh, I have to clean and I should go shop, but I think I will do that tomorrow. Um, yeah. Why did I say that? Yeah. And it was so annoying because I moved some palettes and I broke one. I'm just thankful that because I dropped six um, face palettes on the floor and just one broke and I have ordered a duplicate. <laughs> It was from Maker Revolution, so I was just worried that they wouldn't still have it. God, I'm so sorry. It really tickles. I think I must have gotten something inside the eye. Wow. 
will that be doing that now? This is the Chartreuse Lime Shade that the summer collection are centered around. What are you doing? Come on. Come on. What are you doing? Slut up. And I'm suspecting that I will have to go back and fill in this shade a little bit more. It's almost a bit neon, but yeah. But yeah, it was nice to get a mat here. <laughs> That's uh, the other places I can cope with shimmers much easier, but just here it's easier with a mat. Let's put it a bit higher. I'm so excited to see Malin and Linda's videos with this. And I really hope that they get challenging um, shades. <laughs> Let's do it like that and I will just continue later on to fill it in. And the second shade that we will have in the outer V. Three. Okay. It's Alien. That's my favorite shade in this palette. It's the shimmer green. That is not an easy shade to have there, but we can work with it. I would like to have a spray, please. Where are you? Did I just spin the whole way around us? This never ends. Ends. I can never run out of it. I have used it so much. I was so close to putting it on, on the lid, but it's in the outer V. And I am spraying it because it's not... Otherwise, I don't think I will like the shade that much. Sometimes I spray the shimmers when I don't have them on the lid, but sometimes I don't. Oh, now Linda is sending a message. They have already filmed their videos and I'm late as usual because yeah, things are not as they should be, but they are getting better. And that's the important thing. And now I'm just placing it like I would have placed any shade here. Let's hope I don't get a dark shade on the lid. Because then it will look really weird. And I'm taking more of the abduction shade. Just to blend it a bit. Here. Like that. Really love this alien shade. It's so pretty. I think that's the shade I chose when I did the collab with Anya. Well, let's keep it like that. And now I'm going to get the shade for my lid. Oof. Mm. 11. Ugh. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Oh, it's a shimmer at least. It's moon rock. I have uh, had kind of good luck with the shades. It's not boring shade. I don't think... Now I took the wrong shade. I took UFO. UFO, that's not what we call it. UFO. That's not the shade. <laughs> But this is dark, so we'll see how this looks. Ooh. That's so pretty. I don't think I have used this shade before. Oh my god, that's pretty. And it works really well with these shades because it's a mix between green and gold and yellow, kind of. Good. Like that. And it 
it was not that dark, thank God. And I, it doesn't matter what I get on the lower lash line because everything will work there. Um, whether it's a dark or a light or a shimmer or a matte. The only thing is that if I get like the black hole or something like that, it will be a very dark look. But um, yeah, I want to take more of the alien shade. But we go into each other. These are so good. This is how a shimmer should perform. Now we take the abduction again. The only thing is that I don't get that type of gradient since it is a shimmer I have in the outer V. But I'm trying to blend them a bit together. Yeah, then we're picking number for the lower lash line. Okay. Nine. <laughs> it won't make a difference. Is that nine? No. Oh, I thought I got that shade. I can't count. But nine is obviously the flying saucer one. So it will be a green look. That does not bother me at all. Bother. Bother. Bother me. And I don't want to ruin the print. So I'm taking it down here. Now please don't get the black shade. Put it in a corner. I got an all the green shades. That's good. Thank you, random number generator. Clear up filter. Ooh. It always looks really weird before you get all the other stuff on your face. Oh, don't put the brush in. Mm -hmm. Then we will get in a corner and I'm really hoping for a... Uh, do you say low number? Because all the high numbers are dark. Four. Ooh, I'm so lucky. <laughs> I got the inner stellar. Hee <laughs> hee. I'm so pleased. <laughs> it doesn't look dark at least. Ooh. It's a green duochrome. I didn't know that. I probably have a video where I say the same thing, but I did not know that this is a, it doesn't look like that. It's a gold. Here it looks like a gold, but when I put it in the eye, it looks really green. God, I'm so lucky. If I am super lucky, I will get a matte dark shade to put in the outer corner. A little bit to darken it up, but yeah. Let's see, what's the last shade? Nine. I have already used nine, so I will take a new number. Eight. Okay. I got the Martian Soil. It's the yellow shade. I think I will actually take that in the outer here. Let's see. Vad är det? Just to make it a bit more here. Make it a bit darker. Yeah. 
because the sixth shade we could put wherever we want it. Like that, and then we get this shade. Now this brush and just blend them. It looks really crazy now when I don't have face makeup and anything. <laughs> but yeah, um, I'm going to fix, you know, my days and my eyeliner and such. And then I will be back. Maybe this will be a short video. But that's just because I am so lucky with the shades. Well, I'll be back anyway. Hello! Now I'm back and I just realized when I <laughs> turned the camera on that I don't have anything on my lips. Yeah, why should I why should I put on my lips? Hmm. Let's take this one. Now I have the mirror here, so sorry. Oh god no, not that one. I can't have the mirror there because I'm not seeing anything. This is the Lolita. From Cat on D, obviously. It's my favorite liquid lipstick formula. I have a few that I like really much, but this is the most comf comfortable comfortable one it's easy to apply and it doesn't fade away weird uh, i love these but i have not bought any new ones in forever because i have so many <laughs> because i bought mini sets at christmas they didn't have that this year God, I was uneven. Never mind. Just ignore that. Oh, it looks so much darker here. But yeah. Like that. Now I'm done. And I really like the look. And I think I was very lucky uh, i'm going to show you again even though you already know because you've probably been here the whole video but i got abduction it's a matte chartreuse color that i got in the crease then i got alien the shimmery green in the outer v <sighs> then i got moon rock on the lid if i would have done this look myself i wouldn't have put the darker shimmer in you know on the lid but the other way around but yeah never mind then i got a uh, flying saucer under the eye and then i got inner stellar which looks like a gold shade but i think it really looks green here in the inner corner but yeah how lucky was that uh, and then I got Martian soil to put wherever I want. So I just took a little bit out here, darken it up a bit. Oh, I, my lips are crooked. Well, ignore that. Uh, yeah, so this was the Alien palette. And this is the fifth collab with lovely Marlene and Linda. And as always, they will be linked down below. And I think I got very, very lucky in this video because we did, you know, random number and we had to put them in a special order. I just got the feeling that they weren't that lucky, but we'll, we'll have to see. Uh, I would, oh, this works for me. <laughs> um, and yeah, this is obviously a shorter video. I have some stuff to do. I really don't want to do them right now, but that's life um i have tried a new brow product from revolution 
that was easy to use. And I have a Makeup Geek Highlighter, Too Faced Blush and Kat Von D um, Bronzer and Contour, if you wonder. Um, my hair looks disturbing, but yeah. So yeah, that was the finished look. Uh, and when you see this, I am going to watch Molly and Linda's videos to see what they got. <laughs> Evil laughter. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, I think that was all. I'm so bad at ending my videos. But yeah. Bye.